So I'm standing here on Pemberton Court. It's a beautiful cul-de-sac in Whitby, and I'm excited to show you this house, 24 Pemberton Court. This house is over 3,000 square feet with approximately $300,000 spent in renos and upgrades. Let's walk inside and we're going to go in through the double door entry. Notice the beautiful black doors with the transom window. What a beautiful entry we have in this house. Let's now go into the living room. Notice the hand-carved, one-of-a-kind mahogany fireplace. It has a Napoleon electric fireplace insert with a remote control. This is a sunken living room, as you can see. We have six pot lights and they're anti-glare trim around the outside of the pot lights and all the bulbs are LED. As we walk into the dining room, you can see how large it is. We have our eight person dining room table here. And you're looking at the chandelier right now. It's a custom designed chandelier with suspended bubble effect. The living room and dining room have custom drapery in faux silk royal blue treatment. We're back in the hallway now and as we walk towards the kitchen and family room, we're going to pass the office. Get ready for this stunning kitchen. It's a gourmet, custom, multi-tone kitchen with lacquered cherry wood and stainless steel appliances. Here we have a Pro Capital II oven range with six gas burners and a barbecue grill. And above it, we have a pro stainless steel range hood. You're looking now at the seven foot island with a breakfast bar. It has seating for three, as you can see with the three stools. We're looking now at the Electrolux built-in tall fridge and separate built-in tall freezer with an ice maker. So this house has two dishwashers. You've got a stainless steel Miele dishwasher here. And in the center island, you have a second dishwasher, which is right over here. It's also Miele. And since we're talking about two, we have two sinks. There's one sink right here under the window. And there's one sink over here as we walk towards the dining room. So notice here as well, we have a Bosch built-in espresso coffee machine with a remote control. And there's also a Bosch convection oven that has a remote control. And we also have a built-in warming drawer. As we walk around into the dining room, notice the servery. The kitchen continues into the dining room, which is a nice transition, but also a nice touch. While we're looking at the servery, have a look at the four glass upper cabinet doors with glass shelves. And it also has genuine crystal cabinet doorknobs. And the base doors are touch latch base doors. As we walk back in through the kitchen, just want to point out that all the doors and drawers are soft close doors and drawers. Before we have a look at the family room, let's just step outside and have a look at this beautiful backyard. Very private with trees all around. You're looking now at the 18 by 32 oval in-ground pool. In case you're wondering, the vinyl liner was recently replaced, as were the pool jets, and the pool pump was purchased in 2016. So the pool is ready for you to swim in. 
So as you can see from the elevation, this is a walkout basement, which is fantastic. And we're gonna go have a look at the basement shortly, but I just wanna point out it is a legal basement apartment registered with Whitby. So you can enjoy the backyard from the main house and you can enjoy it from the basement. There's a nice flow from the kitchen into the family room. We have eight hot lights in the family room. And just as we have on the second floor, notice the upgraded baseboards on this level as well. Powder room has a marble basket weave mosaic floor tile and a floating high gloss black custom vanity with granite countertop and Kohler branded fixtures. Notice again the crystal cabinet knobs. We're gonna walk into the office now, which we passed by as we were walking to the kitchen. The entrance to the office has double pocket doors. We have floor to ceiling built-in storage and a built-in printer area hidden behind the doors. There are also four oversized filing cabinet drawers. All doors and drawers are soft closed as they were in the kitchen. Before we go upstairs, let's take a sneak peek into the laundry room, which leads into the double car garage with the door. Now that we're done with the main floor, let's head on upstairs to the second floor. At the top of the stairs, notice this beautiful Austrian crystal chandelier over the stairwell, and right above it is a skylight. The second floor landing has this really nice, generous area, which could be a study nook or just a little sitting area. There's also pot lights up here. And notice also the upgraded baseboards. Heading into the master bedroom, we have a double door entry. And a beautiful, large master bedroom. So let's walk through the dressing room before we get into the ensuite washroom. The dressing room has closet organizers including soft closed drawers, pull out valet, pull out belt racks, tie racks, and chrome rods. Before looking at the next three bedrooms, let's just go into the common four-piece washroom. Now we're going to walk through and have a look at the remaining three bedrooms. So here we are in the basement, and as I pointed out earlier, this is a two-bedroom legal registered basement apartment. Notice the large windows. The layout is open concept with the living room, dining room, and kitchen, and momentarily we'll go have a look at the two bedrooms. So as we walk into the kitchen, uh, notice that we have a center island with quartz countertop. We also have LED under cabinet lighting, soft closed drawers and doors. So we're walking towards one of the two bedrooms down here. It's a spacious bedroom with a double closet and an above grade window and an entrance to the washroom, which is the common washroom for the basement. The washroom has a marble vanity with an undermount sink and an oversized shower with a light as well. And the 
from the foyer, we can see that there's a laundry here. So we have two laundries in this house, here in the basement, and one for the upper level. Before we head back upstairs, let's have a quick look at the other bedroom. This bedroom is also a very generous size and has a closet and an above grade window.